Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and in this video I'll be showing you how to do some basic color corrections for your pictures in Photoshop. So let's get started. The pictures I'm going to talk I'm talking about is like the pictures you add in your GFX pack. If you anyone if anyone of you are downloaded GFX pack, you know how it is. So I'm just gonna show you that. And mainly people use some gaming pictures or some pictures they choose which one they like. I'm just gonna take the game picture so you can choose well, whichever picture you want so let's get started first just you just need to make a background a duplicate background layer and just hide this one so you can see there are these three, these three characters over here I don't want them I'm just what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make the background dark all these background and I'm not gonna make these characters that much dark so I just have to cut them off from the background so take make a new layer and that's gonna do a quick work quick rough work you can you have to take time it's okay if you take time and do work slowly it's the best so I'm just gonna do it a uh, quick work so I have done my work of selecting these and now I'm just gonna do is just control plus C and take the new layer which is transparent so transparent which is empty and control plus V and now we have our characters in another layer so this is much I want I don't want much more this is enough for me for the video purpose so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna keep this layer open and take the background layer and now what you need to do is you have to make the background dark so you have to take the brush tool, take this brush and set the size which you have to do here and go and check some dark color like dark blue. I think this color is pretty much okay for this purpose. I'm just gonna make it a little bit. Yeah, this color is okay and now what you need to do is make another new layer and you have to color it on that new layer. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna paint it over here. So I uh, have painted a little bit. So and go here and just change it to overlay. So you can see that you got a nice effect over there, which is pretty good. So now what we have to do is we can add multiple colors on that so i'm just gonna select a color of pretty much the same shade i think this color is okay if you want to see you you want to use this color in your video you can see that the code is here 6000 and ff i'm just gonna give okay and just gonna paint it over here you can see that getting a nice little effect over here it's gonna make it a little bit darker and darker Okay, and you can even add another layer which is a little bit different from the one door two we used so I'm just gonna make it a little bit brighter than this one and I'm gonna take this to get that nice effect and this much is pretty okay so at the corners at the corners of each uh, side you can add a little bit darker color to make it there you not know, that much shiny and this much is okay for our background and take the main layer which we have the characters on where we have to work a lot so take that layer make a new layer over there and you have to take another color which is not that much dark so I'm just gonna first go with the red gonna paint red over here and make sure it is also on overlay so you can get this effect over here and I'm gonna take another layer which is sorry not another layer another color which is cool sorry my fault just gonna make it and you can see I'm getting a nice little effect over there it probably looks pretty good gonna paint these people 
and what I often do is if I to make any place like more showing or more you know people look at that place and so I'm just gonna give a white mark over here and on his face and just take another layer so not another layer another color I'm just gonna go with this green and just gonna paint it on his face just gonna do that it looks pretty good I'm not lying and I have to go with another color also what about the yellow yellows are also nice so I'm just gonna do some multiple colors right now and I think this much is pretty enough I'm just gonna say pretty enough not or my full potential it's, it's okay just it's just okay so what we gonna do next is you can go to a color balance and do stuff over there like this looks pretty hot I think this is okay and you can go to the curves and it's pretty much dark over here now and I'm again gonna take another layer take the white put it over here 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 and here and make it overlay and this much is pretty good I think that this much it looks pretty good though and I'm gonna make it a group just like group 1 just gonna name it all and what I'm gonna do is next I'm going to add some text over here so where's the text okay I have to take white and I'm gonna add color first I have to select the font and I'm gonna make it white color correction and I'm gonna just make ok and ctrl plus d to Make it like this. Just gonna align it in the center. I think this font is not good that much. It's gonna take some bold font, which is pretty professional looking. I'm using this next star bold font, which you can easily find. So I I personally love this font, so I'm just gonna use that gonna make it a little bit smaller I think this much is enough make it a little bit bigger and I'm gonna add a gradient or something on it So I think this gradient looks uh, that gradient looked a little bit funny so I'm just gonna put it like this and I'm gonna add a subtext to it sorry I'm just gonna type in Photoshop okay I'm just gonna go to this characters and all and I'm gonna increase the space between these characters Five. Okay, wrong area. Type it again. Photoshop. 
and okay I'm not getting it so I'm just gonna leave that aside so I'm just gonna make it like this it's gonna be pretty much over here enter okay that's too much I think that's enough so I'm just gonna gain take it and control plus T and now we get this cool effect over here control plus T and I'm gonna click on control plus T with this one and I'm just gonna make it a little bit smaller and I'm gonna place it over here so it looks pretty good like this is what I think it's pretty good I don't know what to say right now so if you are like this or written on the bottom you can just crop it or like anything so it would look pretty good so thanks for watching the video make sure to subscribe make sure to turn that bell icon on so you can get notification when I upload new videos which I'm gonna I'm gonna do soon and thanks for watching See you next video.